breaking of the commandments. In that slate, where all those things were recorded, is the name Jesus Christ, my righteousness. And that wiping away is found in Acts 3.19 of our sins. It's found in Colossians 2.14 of handwriting. It's found in Revelation 3.5 of a name in a book. It's found in Revelation 7.17 of tears being wiped away. In my office at the house, I have a plaque over my desk. It's about this wide and about this high. And I keep it there so I can look at it all the time. You know what it says? I keep it there as a reminder. This is what the plaque says. It has a, a big picture of a crown of thorns. And on the plaque it says, He paid a debt he didn't know because I had a debt I couldn't pay. I keep that there so I can look at it every day and remind myself that I couldn't pay the debt, but he paid it for me. He paid a debt he didn't owe because I had a debt I couldn't pay. On the cross, Jesus wiped away all my sins. Nailed the law to the cross. In the cross of Christ I glory, standing o'er the wrecks of time, all the light of sacred glory stands around his name sublime. Where is your hope this morning? I cannot understand the woe that thou wert pleased to bear. Dear dying lamb, I only know that all my hope is there. Where is your hope this morning? Is it in Christ? Is it at Calvary where he paid the debt and set you free? I trust that it is. Let's stand together, please, and be dismissed in prayer. And as we pray this morning, Brother Jim, would you dismiss us, please, in prayer? Father, we thank you for speaking through our pastor and helping us to understand about the way that men teach their philosophies about your, about your word. We thank you, Lord, for helping us and giving us more understanding of how we're supposed to understand the Bible. It's very simple. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord, for discussing with us today. I ask you, Lord, to guide us and protect us throughout the day and give us traveling mercies wherever we may be going. Guide us and protect us, Lord, in Christ Jesus' name. Amen.